Hey guys, Iowa Bird Chaser. We are now in Hancock County and we're gonna head over to this piece of property that's got some standing corn and see what happens. No bird, come, no bird, come. Come, no bird! Are you kidding me? What the hell happened? No bird, come! Good girl. All right, guys, we we just went up to Winnebago County for a little bit. It was terrible. I didn't like it. So we're back in Hancock, uh, where we were about hour, hour and a half ago. So here we are. No bird, come! I was kind of expecting a hen there, but I knew with as tall as this corn was and how birdie she was, something was probably tucked down right there in the corn. I'm gonna have to look at that footage. I felt like I was right ahead of him. 
I know I tickled him once, but gosh, we gotta quit tickling him today. Man. Hancock County continues. Did you find a birch today? <laughs> hey everyone, Iowa Bird Chaser here. I just wanted to give you a quick update. It's Wednesday, November 6th. We knocked Cerro Gordo County off the list. Was able to hunt a beautiful piece of property that I pinpointed virtually on the map last night. Uh, after I got done doing the Ringnecks and Retrievers, Flushman and Dustin podcast. Follow those guys if you don't already on Instagram, Ringnecks and Retrievers. Great content those guys are putting out. Um, but scouted this place looked awesome on the map and then got in there today and only saw one bird one rooster I dropped it and that's that so that was pretty nice and then uh, came over to Hancock County had just an absolute beautiful point rooster gets up gun goes click I got this new Franke Affinity 3 it uh, if you don't get the first shell put in nice and if the receiver doesn't go nice and tight <clears throat> the gun won't fire so that was kind of annoying so I had to rack that real quick put another shell in tickled it saw some feathers come off but it never went down then I missed two others um, later on in kind of the same area in Hancock County so it was seeing the birds we saw about um, I'd say 10 hens five, four or five roosters I can't recall I think four so uh, we're gonna be back in Hancock tomorrow and then we're gonna kind of work our way south I think we're going to try to maybe hit Franklin County um, and just keep kind of heading south back home. So we'll see what happens tomorrow. Today the birds are rolling really tight, so hopefully tomorrow they're doing the same thing. That'd be fantastic, but appreciate you guys following along. Hey everyone, Iowa Bird Chaser here. We're back in Hancock County. It's Thursday, January 7th. <clears throat> we are to the field a little early just trying to scout. We were doing some hunting here yesterday. We saw quite a few birds. Had definitely our opportunity and just couldn't connect. So there's some standing corn right over here I'm gonna keep an eye on for the next half hour. And then uh, we're gonna walk this a little different than I did yesterday to see if we can get some different results. The birds were holding really tight yesterday, which was fantastic. So hopefully we can get them to hold tight again today. And uh, Sophie's excited, she's ready to go. I'm ready to go, I'm pumped up. We're going to tackle a few more counties today hopefully we'll, we'll at least hunt in we're going to be starting here in hancock then we're going to work our way kind of south and uh, finish around the franklin area so i believe wright county might be between us i got it on my map but i was doing a lot of research last night was looking at a lot of different counties and i kind of forget what's what at this point but i just know i haven't harvested anything up in this area so we're in uh we're in new territory which is great but um, hopefully we get some action for you today Fetch it up! Fetch! Fetch! Fetch it up! Fetch it up! Fetch! It's 807! 807 Hancock County's done, baby! Woo! bad bird. Look at that. Look at that. 50 yards off the road. 
He was right in here. I knew he was coming. The dog kind of went on. So basically what happened was, so basically what happened was, I'm getting ready out here in the truck. I look over, the dog's like on point looking in the middle of the road. And I'm thinking, is there one in the ditch? Like, I get ready quiet, but all of a sudden, then I look up probably 80 yards down the road, I see this rooster fly across the road and he land just real calm right back here in this, in this weedy stuff. Just landed real calm in there, wasn't worried about anything. I said, you know what? We're going after him, why wouldn't you? And uh, the rest is history. We got him up, we dropped him, one shot. Appreciate Chris for the advice as far as uh, staying with the steel shop. And uh, man, we're just gonna head on out to Wright County now and then Franklin hopefully. So we're gonna try to get our three bag limit, three different counties, that'd be awesome.